Shalom, Body of Christ. Today is November the 12th, 2023. With the key of David, I'm going to place the cloak of invisibility over this communication, over our minds, bodies, hearts, and spirit, in holy Ashaya's name. Aman. I want to give all of the glory to Father Ahaya, our Mashiach, Holy uh, Yeshaya, and Holy Spirit, uh, Ruach HaKodesh. Okay, so Body of Christ, I have to give you some insight. I have to give you some um, background so that you understand uh, that the most important thing that you can do, especially in this hour where we're seeing a lot of prophecy come to fruition and, um, you know, the days are evil. So it's very important that you do not be deceived. Remember that the word is your weapon. The word is your compass. Okay, those are words that Father has had me repeat continually to the body of Christ. Okay, so the context in which I have to share with you openly is instruction, a summoning uh, that Father had summoned me uh, like three days ago. It was two to three days ago. Um, Father had summoned me and he said that he needed for me to meet him at the steps at 5 a.m., that he would be giving me instruction. Okay, that instruction would be voiced through this podium that he has made available for me to speak through. I give him all of the glory, all of the honor and all the praise. He alone is worthy to be exalted. Amen. Okay, this is what I was shown last night. I was shown a month, the month of September. It was not, um, it didn't have a year. Okay. The year was not marked on it. So just a gentle disclaimer, as I posed in the um, the word yesterday that I had to speak. And if you have not watched that video, please do to understand this one. Please, um, if you could, please, if you haven't already, just if you're already subscribed, hit the little bell so that you get these in sequential order as we receive the instruction from Father Ahaya. OK, and again, with anything, especially in these days where they are very evil and we're seeing prophecy be fulfilled at an accelerated rate, it is your obligation and you want to avoid being deceived. Make sure you verify and confirm, take to prayer to Father Ahaya directly if indeed this is genuinely from him. OK, any video that you watch, OK, make sure you get your confirmation Go straight to Father Ahaya and receive your confirmation. Okay, so in this um, vision that he showed me at 5 a.m. this morning, because, again, he had instructed me to meet him, um, that I would be receiving a fresh anointing, okay? And and I'm very humbled and I'm very grateful and, I'll, again, giving him all of the glory, but you have to have this context for you to understand this, okay? As I go forth... As I'm being called to do so, I have to put that in there so, for you to understand this. And please, again, take to take to prayer, get your confirmation that that is indeed true. Okay, so I was shown at 5, 5 a.m. this morning, and I had asked Father Ahaya during uh, prayer, Father, what would you have me, what would you show me to convey to the body of Christ? Because again, this summoning, excuse me, came with... Um, I would be receiving instruction to convey to the body of Christ. At that point, he showed me a calendar, an unmarked calendar. And what I mean by that, it did not have a year. I was shown the month of September. Okay, the month of September. Please, please just be reminded, Father speaks to us in parables. And perhaps he's doing this especially right now because he wants the body of Christ to come together and work in unity. In this vision, he showed me the month of September on an unmarked calendar as far as the year goes. However, he did show me that the days, um, the 5th, the 6th, and the 7th were blacked out. I'm going to repeat that again. This calendar marked September. The days of the 5th, 6th, and 7th were blacked out. Okay. Now, what did come to mind is September stems from the number seven. If you look into the etymology, if you look into the meaning of September, it actually stems from the number seven and not the month, the ninth month. OK, so please be aware of that. 
Now, what he did bring to light this morning as I was getting pre prepared to speak this word to the body of Christ, he reminded me that the um, the coming feast day of Hanukkah, and I don't know why. All I know is that's what he put in my spirit. That's why I'm sharing it here. Now, what also uh, came to mind is a brother in Christ. Yesterday, if you watched the video of December, um, Priest David mentioned in the comments that he had received something about December as well. And I had no knowledge of it. I had no prior knowledge of it. Um, he was calling my attention to it. Um, but we we got to talking just a little bit on Instagram, on Inbox, and um, we both made the connection to Hanukkah. And I was like, hmm, I wonder why Father keeps bringing this up, right? Now, again, I'm not date setting. I'm, I, too, have to use my spiritual discernment, and I have to also uh, rely on my brothers and sisters to work in unity so we can figure this out, because each of us have a piece of the puzzle that another may not have, okay? So again, as soon as I was showing this calendar of September, Father brought to mind that September stems from the number seven, finality, completion, right? Okay, so then that's where also he reminded me of my conversation um, via Instagram with Priest David. So I knew that he wanted me to share that highlight of Hanukkah. And we know, and the reason the connection is, uh, Hanukkah, if if it's the correct dates, um, it's marked on on the Google calendar as the starting the evening of the seventh. That's what caught my attention. Okay, so I'm going to leave it there at that. The connection to seven. Also, Father brought a couple of uh, scriptures. He downloaded these in my spirit as again I was preparing uh, to give you this word. Um, so I'm going to read those to you in Revelation chapter one verse thirteen. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot, and girt about the paps with a golden girdle. Revelation chapter 1 through 16. Then I turned to see the voice that was speaking with me, and having turned, I saw seven golden lampstands okay i'm going to leave it at that i know that we are the candlesticks so um father has disclosed that to us he has revealed that to us that we are the candlesticks um but i just needed to be obedient and share this with you all in case that it resonates with you again if you're led to share uh, the video at this hour where father is speaking very very mightily and again, I give him all of the, the glory and the honor. I'm very, very grateful. Very, very grateful. I pray that this blesses you. Um, please, please, again, uh, sorry, I'm a little bit rushed here. Please, again, uh, share if you're led. Uh, and uh, please confirm if you have been receiving uh, similar words, please contribute. I give Father a high all the glory. And I pray that this has blessed you. Amen.